Chickens! 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 Well, guys, unfortunately, my poor lady in here. Now she just went inside, but she's all tore up. Look at her. So I'm gonna separate her for right now. I I hadn't seen her like that. I don't know if that just happened over the last couple days. She's the only one that's like that. Maybe she's been hiding in the coop. But it's the roosters, I think, that are tearing her up. From what I can see when she was out here, they were just all over. But she's the only one that I see that's like that. So we're going to start calling these roosters. We got way too many, and that's the problem, I think. We got those two white ones. And I think all those. I think all, there's like five of them right there. They're all roosters. So they're going to be cold and eaten. And you know, these guys, you can tell, I don't, well, maybe you can't. Buffs are kind of puffy, but you can tell they're malting. So that's part of it too, I'm sure. And this is probably why I didn't notice that she was messed up she just wants to sit inside it looks like i'm sorry girl you all right man we need to clean this coop out it's all nasty in there this is where the babies are <sighs> definitely need to clean that coop my barred rocks they look all good so i'm gonna let them run around out here and I'm going to leave her in there for the rest of the day. Uh, we got another one in here. What are you doing in there? Are you going to come out? Are you, are you scared too? So yeah, we got half a dozen at least roosters. We need to go ahead and just kill them and eat them. Because I'm not hatching any chicks anytime soon. And... I'm not even sure that, uh, yeah, she's, she's malting too, but I can't really see any big marks on her, but there's just too many roosters over here for, there's a lot of hens too, but they, you know how they are, they get their favorite hen, and then they just start, start really, uh, ganging up on her. I'm just surprised that there's not more of them, but I guess that's a good thing. We only got to worry about one. I hope she wasn't attacked by something, but she doesn't really have any like fresh open wounds or anything. It looks like mostly it's just a little bit of bruising, some dried blood, and just feathers missing. So I think she'll be all right, but... I'm going to go ahead and separate her for right now. <laughs> yeah, you can see there. She's pretty messed up looking. But I don't see any, like, signs of any kind of infection or anything. And it, nothing, no fresh, you know, like, bleeding right now. So, I don't know. I don't know. Alright, well anyway, 
so we'll get around to that this weekend we're gonna we're gonna eat them and be done with that i don't want to feed them anymore either so I mean, you see that guy's a rooster that guy that guy them two right there are roosters i think it's kind of hard to tell still a little bit on some of them look at him fighting these guys are this guy's super aggressive too he took the worst thing from Ro the rhode island red the aggressiveness because he's pretty he's got that rose look at him <laughs> that's see that's probably the difference she ain't taking it so and another thing too is i seen i seen him my wife freaking try to tie their legs together like that's gonna do something let's see how he's got he's got his legs like tied together <laughs> it didn't work look this one's got it too he seems all right though look at him poor guy i can't catch him to get him back off of there so we're just gonna have to wait till tomorrow when we Kill them off. They're just tearing up my poor hen over here. This might be Big Mama. It kind of looks like Big Mama. She's got the flappy comb. I kind of thought she was a little bit more dominant than the rest, but man, she's been tore up. Look at that. Like I said, everything seemed pretty clean in there. I didn't see any, uh, any kind of infection or nothing, nothing festering. And she seems fine. But earlier, they uh, come over and one of, the, one of the one of the brown roosters jumped on her, and then one of the other ones came over and started pecking on her while she while the other one was on top of her. So I just think it's probably just having so many roosters is the issue, the real issue. So, but at least we only have one hen that's in bad shape and like i said i think we can just go ahead and off all the roosters just off all of them that way we don't have to worry about this stuff and then we might be able to go ahead and put them other guys with them if we don't have any roosters but it might be a little bit early they're still pretty small but they free range together all the time and don't seem to have a whole lot of problems Again. <laughs> Interesting. That's Esmeralda. She's pretty, probably pretty dominant too. She's one of the older hens too. So the buffs and the and her. Look at them. the buffs and her. That's why I'm kind of surprised one of those buffs is all messed up. I'm. I'm kind of worried maybe she got hit by a hawk or something trying to eat her and it wasn't a rooster but it's hard to tell hopefully she'll just get get all healed up and we'll just keep her away from the rooster for right now just to be safe Well, that's it for this one guys i just want to give you a little chicken update my poor little buff hen over there is having a little bit of trouble but uh, i think she's going to be okay i'll give you some updates if uh, anything changes and we're going to be getting some chicken meat tomorrow finally kind of cashing in on the on all the feed that i've been spending feeding all these roosters but that's part of it. When you hatch them out, you're going to have, you know, at, if you're lucky, probably 50% are going to be roosters. So we've already, um, we've already, uh, butchered probably half, half a dozen of them. 
so far from the first two um, hatchings. And so we got another half dozen probably to do this time. And then eventually we'll get these other guys, these, uh, these smaller guys here. They're another couple months away. Oh, here's one right here. All right, guys, that's it for this video. Hit the like button, share, subscribe if you haven't already. And until next time, thanks for watching.